like to introduce to you the making of natural plant-based milks. We're going to make some almond milk to start with, with flavorings like dates, a little bit of orange peel, just to give it a little kick at the end, we might just add a little cinnamon. Now plant milks are an important alternative to receive calcium in the body without using milk or any other animal-based products. We're going to use Chufamix today. And Chufamix is a very easy nut and vegetable milk maker. It's composed of very simple components, a water container, and they're all BPA-free. There is a sieve which is made of stainless steel, mold injected into BPA non-toxic plastic, so it's very hardy, very easy to clean. And there is a mortar which will help you press out all of the milks in one go. So this is a very different method of making nut milks. Today, most people use nut milk bags and a separate blender, but this is all done in one easy step. So let me show you. To start with, I'm going to just put 750 ml of filtered water into the water container. And then I shall put the sieve into the container. I've already soaked my almonds, which is about a cup of almonds. And almonds do have to be soaked because you need to get rid of the enzyme inhibitors on the skin. So I'll just put all of the nuts into the sieve. And it will be very easy then to use a hand blender. Now hand blenders are available very cheaply in a lot of the electrical stores. And what it's going to do is to help me macerate the nuts as well as sieve the milk into the container. So halfway through I'm going to add the seasonings that I mentioned. So I might just add one date for a little bit of sweetness for those of you who like that. I would add a little orange peel because I've noticed that it gives you a little bit of a different kick to the taste of plain almond milk. And then perhaps a touch of cinnamon. Notice there are no additives, no other additives as per package products. This is all natural and plant-based. Almonds are a little harder, so you do have to actually blend for about a minute. There you go. What I have here now is fresh almond milk with certain flavorings to give you that extra taste and sweetness. And I shall now use the mortar to press the rest of the milk out. So notice how easy it is to sieve the milk very quickly. Very different from using a nut milk bag, which could take you about 20 minutes or so just to get pure almond milk out of the nuts. There you go. I shall actually take the sieve out and that shows you the fresh almond milk that we've just made. The pulp itself can be used almost immediately. So if you look at the pulp in here, it's very, very fine. I can take it out with a scoop. And that can be used in other recipes that you will find on our website, which is www.theblucrane.asia. Thank you.